Oh, yeah, I got the middle. There he is. Oh, he's a little red belly. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. Hello, mate. Hello. Hello. Stop being a pork chop. Oi. Is he bleeding? There's some blood there. Where? Or is it me? I might have cut myself on a shell. It feels like I have. Okay. Oh, yeah, I'm bleeding. <laughs> One of those shells was sharp. I'm sorry, sorry. Oh, no, it's not your fault. Hi, bud. That shell there, I think. It's quite serrated. I was riding about the head, about my finger. Yeah. 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 It's beautiful. He's nice and chunky. He's had some food. Yeah, you. <laughs> At least it's not a pie from this time, something different. But yeah, it's because you, you've got gardens and all that, like your neighbours don't have all this. Yeah. Oh, so. it's going to be my problem, is it? <laughs> but, um, well, everyone's, you aren't the only house on the street I've done, that's, if so that makes we, you feel better. In 20 odd years, or 25 years, we only ever had a tie can. Huh? And all of a sudden, well, you, you must have had, yeah, you had the female pipe and so the boys were wandering in is what I reckon was happening there. And now it's just a coincidence that you had the red belly because red bellies and the pythons are very different animals and have like no interest in... They don't like each other. Well, they're just very different. So they don't, they're not even in the same family. So they're not very closely related at all. So they just, they would just be two different snakes doing two different things. We did have a fire here um, in the forest. So this is just a junior? It's a few years old still. Yeah. About a sub adult at this age. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. He's been eating well. You've been eating well, mate. That's fine. If we do. Hey, look at that. Ah! Big bite, I missed it. Hey, oh, I didn't miss it. Yeah. Get him to do it again. I can see the venom. <laughs> I can see the venom. You can see the venom? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hang on. Here come. So, and he actually did that because I moved. I just moved out of the way to come and bring him back out. And that's when he bit, so he might do it again. There we go. There we go. <laughs> but all it is, is because he's feeling afraid and threatened, you know, we're much bigger than them and I'm picking him up. So he's flattening out now because they're very I'm closely moving. related to a cobra. Oh. Yeah, they're in the same family as cobra. They, they were once actually in the same genus as cobras, the Naya genus. And then as they studied them a bit more, they've realized they are genetically different, so now they're um, in the Shadekas genus. I remember, oh, that was when, when I lived at Bonagilla, the red belly was bigger than that, much Oh, they can get to two metres, yeah. yeah. It's fat. So, um, so it's still pretty much a juvenile, it's like a teenager at this, this age, but it's not a baby by any means. Every time the wind blows, it spooks him. A bit nervous. Otherwise, isn't he? yeah. Mate. Oh, might, might just have to put him in. <laughs> He's not getting away. Thanks. He just whacked me in the face oh, with him. Sorry. <laughs> There's a lake right there. Actually, if you ever saw the Bandy Bandy video from Barham Heads, put it into this spot right here. Makes me wonder if it's still in there under the ground somewhere. Probably not. Probably chuffed off somewhere else. Hey, mate. <clears throat> hey. Come on. It's funny, he's don't want to go in the bag and then he's don't want to leave. But we've got a nice spot down here with water and everything for you, mate. Off you go. Hide in that stuff for now. Whatever makes you happy. Beautiful snake, isn't he? I'll let him go. He's already chuffing off through there. We'll just let him go and do his thing. Right, see you, mate. Oh, is that a bong? It's a bong. <laughs> Should actually get rid of that plastic, though. 